All right, here's my review for Nope. And I'm going to review it the way I wish other people would review movies, which is to say I'm not going to spoil a gosh dang thing. In fact, I'm not even going to tell you what it's about. Because for me, a movie review is really just, hey, should I see this? Is this worth my time? I'll watch a movie about anything because, you know, a good director can make any topic interesting. And so the more blind you can go into a movie, the better. So with all of that in mind, here's my super spoiler free review of Nope, just in general, what I thought, how it made me feel. And I hate to say it, but yeah, it was underwhelmed uh i loved jordan peele's first movie i didn't love his second movie at first us i really liked it 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 took me some time and eventually i grew to love it the more i thought about us i was like oh yeah no this is some like heady artsy fartsy cool stuff and so going into nope i had pretty high expectations even if it wasn't going to be a solid movie i thought it would at least try some things and it does but not nearly as much as us And Get Out was cool. It was pretty, you know, a nice, awesome, straightforward horror movie. Just coming from a different voice and having some cool twists to it. Us um, really pushed the envelope in a lot of ways, but kind of lost its track a little bit in terms of being a bit more convoluted or scattered. And Nope plays, plays it pretty straight. It's, for the most part, very simple. And... I didn't feel like it did anything too spectacularly. I thought that it was definitely made to show a few different key scenes that I think Jordan Peele had in mind. And those scenes were great, but in general, that doesn't make a whole movie's worth. And the structure of the movie is very repetitive. And by the end of it, I was sort of, I don't want to, I don't want to say bored, but I was like, all right, you know, let's, let's wrap it up because it just didn't feel like it necessarily had much else going for it. Now, I'd, I'd love to be wrong, and, and I'd love to maybe learn more about this movie over time. Maybe I missed something. Maybe some of the themes went over my head, but I don't, I don't think so. It felt pretty straightforward, so I wish I had lowered expectations going into it, and hopefully this review will give you the expectations where you can enjoy it a bit more than I did. It's still okay. Like, it's still an okay movie. I don't regret seeing it. And I still love Jordan Peele. Like, I, obviously, I want to see what he's going to do next. He's one of the most interesting people making stuff right now. So I'm excited for the next thing. But in terms of, nope, did it live up to the hype? How does it stack to the last two movies? It's not a whole big comparison to me. It's just a average, straightforward sci-fi movie. It's not even a, really a horror movie. Um, I didn't get my, my blood going at any point. So with that, yeah, I hope other people enjoy it more than I did because I wish nothing but the most success for Jordan Peele because he's one of the few people that is at least trying to do some cool stuff. So, yeah, thanks.